20 men and four women, only five of whom will appear in the dock. They're known as the Sevron Network, after the Paris suburb where, at a clandestine mosque, the defendants allegedly became radicalised. Of French, Moroccan, Mauritanian and Algerian nationality, the suspected jihadists are believed to have provided logistical support to the Charlie Hebdo attackers and are also linked to a deadly assault on a Jewish supermarket in Paris two days after the attack on the satirical magazine. The parents of Quentin Roy, a suspect reportedly killed in Syria in 2016, are expected to speak as witnesses at the trial on Tuesday. I know my son. I know who he used to be. He became someone else. Why and how? There are people among the accused who know this. There are witnesses who know. There are people who haven't been called to the stand who know. And there are others out there who know. If it happened to my son, it happened to others. And it's not normal. And we, the parents, have nothing to do with that. The suspects were aged between 20 to 30 years when they left France just before the January 2015 attacks. Some are believed to have been swayed by the Islamic State armed group's declaration of a self-proclaimed caliphate in June 2014. Most of them were reportedly killed in bombings or suicide attacks while fighting for the terrorist group in Syria or Iraq. The court requisitions are scheduled for Thursday, January the 16th, while the verdicts are set to be heard on Friday the 17th.